In this video, I'm going to show you how to split a ticket into multiple payments. This is useful for a customer who wants to pay their ticket or their bill um, using mul multiple different payment methods, or for a group of customers who want to split uh, a bill amongst themselves. So to get started, we're going to make a sale. And for this sale, I think we'll just sell two regular coffees, change the quantity to two, and then we'll tap charge to get to the payment screen. Now, the balance due is $9.10. If we want to apply uh, a cert a payment amount of a cert a payment method with a certain amount, the first thing we do is we tap the area that says tap to change paying amount, and we specify how much of that amount um, is going to be paid by the first payment method. So let's say this is going to be cash, and they're going to pay $5 in cash. So now $5 is going to go towards cash, so we tap cash. And now you can see a new line is created that shows that $5 has been paid via cash, leaving a total balance of $4.10. And let's say the rest of it they're going to do an outside payment, so a credit card terminal that's not connected uh, to the uh, unit itself. So the rest will be $4.10, and that completes the transaction. Um, if you wanted to, say, split it into three cash payments, um, it's the same concept. You tap this area that says tap to change paying amount, and you give the amount for the first cash transaction, let's say $4. And then let's say so you tap cash, so that applies that $4. And let's say the second person or the second payment is going to be $250. That's going to be cash again. And then let's say the third uh payment is just going to be the rest of it is going to go on someone's card on an outside terminal so we just tap outside payment that applies the rest of the 260 and now we have three split uh, three payments um, that are split and uh, that cover the entire balance of the transaction um, once we're satisfied with this we tap complete and we're taken to the receipt screen where we can email text or print the receipt